Hey, what is up, guys? It's uh, Super Cool Duty One to One here, bringing you a tutorial on the Roxio game catching device. Uh, basically, uh, once you've unboxed the device and got the uh, installed and CD, CD with all the software that you need to install to your laptop or, or PC, basically insert it, install it, and then once you installed it, you should have this little this little icon here. Once you've got that little icon, click on it double click on it wait for it to load up it might take a while to load up your first time your first time loading it up it should come up saying join the register now blah 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 just go to uh, register later don't worry about that to capture you go to that but I've already captured my uh, I've already captured my gameplay so you, once you capture your gameplay go onto that capture it that's where you edit and that shows you how to set it up and that blah 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 but I'm taking you already set it up already anyway but with this box show game catching device you can uh, play in 1080p I think it is so basically you can play in basically HD but it ain't it's just below HD better than a a AV you're going to need the component leads as it says there click on there and you can get it from there or you can get it from Maplins or somewhere like that but anyway once you've got your game capture device link it up and capture whatever you want to capture gameplay or whatever go to edit and share this is the, the video soft this is the video software ed editing stuff that comes with it it's alright it's alright for poor beginners but obviously things like Sony Vegas and all that are much better click widescreen once you do that click widescreen and come into here you want widescreen because YouTube's widescreen right up here it's, it's basically put into three parts up here is add content we've got add video add audio add text add overlay add video effect add transition and all that down here you've got the storyline the video line and all that basically here you've got the music video overlay text you can either have it in, in timeline or storyline video be there video be there transition transition and so on uh, up here is your preview window. This is where you preview the what you're making. All right to add a video, you go to add photo slash video. You click on it. I've captured my one here. Saved it as tutorial. Open it up. All right now, this is the video. Press play to play it. You watch it. Nice little bit of sniper. A sort of bit of sniper footage. So the quality is pretty good, but I'm going to show you how to mess around with these brightnesses and all that. What I reckon is pretty good settings. As you say, you got pause, you got go to start, rewind, skip frame, and all that. This this you can uh nice little triple quad there. This you can uh fast forward a little bit or go back slowly. Pause. Right. So that's the storyline. You go to timeline. You can make it smaller. You can crop it smaller, but you can't make it no 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 bigger. If you're if the clips if you're making a montage and the clips are small, see the little hand there. You go like that, and you can you can drag drag it out to make it easy to work with. It just makes it easy to work with if you've got a small clip. Uh. Right, basically you can uh, you can add audio, you can add text, you can add text to it. Click on the add text effects. You've got loads of different text effects, loads of different ones. I like I like this one. This one's quite good. So add it. Add to production or or to add to in internal track selected. So that'd be like this video. If you add another video, it won't be on that. So click yes. Right, where you want to write? I want. Right, so we call duty one two one. You can place it wherever you want. I place it down here. Yeah, there you go. And come down. As you can see here, that's that's it's, that's the timeline for the text. You can move it wherever you want it. You can move it wherever you want it. So it won't. So it won't come out straight away. What you do is you come here, go like that, and the video will play. 
นั่นหมายความว่าเขามาว่าซอยเรียลาไซด์ดูละเอ่อจะนำมาสกิดทุกทีเลยจะคลิกวันนี้มาเพิ่มเอ็กซ์ทุกทีมาสติดเลยนั่นนี่มันคือการใช้ภาพถ่ายทอดคุณสามารถใช้ภาพถ่ายทอดวิดีโอและเอฟเฟกต์ต่างๆมากมายเป็นหลายสีแยกต่างๆมากมายเป็นหลายสีแยกต่างๆมากมายเป็นหลายสีแยกต่างๆ Add it to there, so the video is going to stop playing. Add it to there, so what you can do is, you can do it when he fires the gun, it changes to black and white. So what you do is you go back in frame. Go to there where it ain't, where it ain't black and white, and then when he fires it changes to black and white. And then it'll go back to normal once it goes past. That once it goes past that, I guess normally you can put that wherever you want or whatever you want. Uh, let me just delete that again. Uh, delete that. Uh, you can put transition. So if you, so if you split this video, just split it. Just click on it and press that. Split, split the two videos. Go to storyline. Click on that. Add transition. Those different ones. You can add whatever you want. If you want to do sand, add and replace. So like that, and then go to that. You play the video, and then when it goes to the other video, it'll be a little transition effect. Sorry if you can hear the hear the gameplay. All right. Now, video set right up here is to add to add Finny to add the、uh, commentary. You go to that. To add text, you go to that. So you just click on it, and if you want to add it, if you want to add it, go to that. Add that. Go to microphone. Okay. And you go to record. So if I record now, it says three, two, one. Thought was pretty good. And look, blah 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 blah. Sniper bang. Press stop. And now that will be saved to it. Click on it. Go done. And that will be saved on it now. What? We say done. There you go. Set add text, and you can add text. You can add audio. You can add music and stuff. Uh. Right now, basically, click on that to get the best. If you get the best sort of settings. You're gonna want to put、uh, what is it? 57, 57, 68, 68, and 73. I know it looks really, really bright now, but that's the best settings when you when you.、Uh, When you export it, it's the best settings, right? Now to export, you want to come to it. You can't do it straight to YouTube, but it ain't that good to really quickly go to export. Don't don't save it because it'll just take up thingy. Right. Once you come to it, you want to go to PAL, whatever you got it as PAL, but I'll do it that NTSC is the best one. And then you want to do it either DIX, DIVX HD 720 30. Or DIXE HD 720 60. 60 is quite a big file, so I normally do this one. Click on it, save it as whatever you want to save it as. I put tutorial. And then once you once you save it, click where you want to put it. Go to create file, and it should come up like that. And then it can take quite a while, depending on how long the file is. Uh, please please like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching this video. Peace out.